Automatic Addison. In this tutorial, we're going to walk through step-by-step -step how to install Python on Ubuntu Linux. Whether you're setting up your development environment for the first time or updating to the latest version, this tutorial will ensure you get Python installed correctly on your system. I am going to start by creating a file for all the code I will write in this tutorial. Let's open a terminal window right now and let's type the following commands. I'm going to do make dir to make a directory, space and then hyphen p, space and then tilde forward slash documents and then forward slash and then python underscore tutorial. Press enter, we just made our directory and now let's move into it. So I'm going to do cd space tilde forward slash and then documents and then Python tutorial. All you have to do is press the P and then type the tab button so that you can do autocomplete. And now let's start by checking which version of Python we have installed. Let's do Python three and then space and then double and then version, double hyphen and then version. We have Python 3.12.3. This command tells you the version of Python three that is currently installed. If Python three is not installed, or if you need a different version, we can install it using Ubuntu's package manager tool. And that will be these commands. Let's clear out the terminal. Do sudo apt get update, enter. Type the password. We will update our package list. Let it do its thing. Let's clear out the terminal, get all that gobbledygook out of the way. And here is the command that you would use. You do sudo sudo apt apt hyphen get and then get and then install and then python3. And then you press enter. All right. And you can see we already have it installed, but that's how you would install python3 if you did not already have it installed. Now, if you also need pip, which is the Python package installer, you can install it by typing the following command, sudo apt apt install and then python3 hyphen pip and then enter. And there you go. We already have pip installed, but that's how you would install pip. After the installation has completed, you can verify that Python and pip are installed correctly by repeating the version check for Python and also checking pip by typing pip three space double hyphen and then version. All right, and here you can see the version of Python you have installed and the version of pip you have installed. So that's it. That's all there is to it, to installing Python in Ubuntu Linux. You now have Python and pip installed on your Ubuntu system. And with Python set up, you are ready. You're ready to start developing applications, including those for robotics projects. Thank you, and I will see you in the next tutorial.